Hello and welcome. In this video we're going to take a look at creating a slide style from a template. To make a start we're going to go to show, show templates, open template which will open the show template dialog box. There you are. Thank you very much. Scrolling down to the bottom to the faces one I produced and clicking on load. There's the template from the load also available on the Faces and Frames DVD. Scrolling across I thought this one would make a very good show start. You can't use the entire template you can only use a single frame for a slide style. Let's take a look. We're going to double click on it. That opens the slide option dialog box. The slide slide styles that's where you want to navigate your way to. Once you're here we're going to click create. It's now asking us for a name it's going to call it slide style 2 by default because I've got slide style 1 there or we can call it whatever we want. I'm going to call it 2 times slides and where do you want to keep it? The category you want to put it under. Well you've got a choice of these here but I'm going to leave it under my own slide styles and a description. Well it's uh, two slides I'm trying to think what to say about the two slides. Top Flies right. So in other words, just a brief description of what happens. Publisher's name, website address, the aspect ratio. It ticked the box here if you want to use it with any of the aspect ratios. In other words, 4 by 3 widescreen at 16 by 9 or custom. The compatibility with Pro Show Gold. Now if you tick this box here, any keyframes, and as you can see from this in the background there, it has got a keyframe with it. So if you tick this box, that keyframe will be removed and you won't see it in Pro Show Gold. So I'm going to leave both of these unticked. That's showing me a thumbnail how it will look. Let's click OK to that. And let's just take a look. There it is there. Right, let's click OK. Next thing, we're going to come and click New. No, we're not going to save the template. Thank you very much. Just going to create a basic show. There it is. And we're going to select these two slides. This one, pressing down, holding down control, clicking on the slide underneath so they're both highlighted, dragging them into slide number one. The plus symbols there showing they're both being copied in. And now we can double click. Come into slide styles. We're going to click on this one here and it's showing a little preview there. It's actually saying the bits and pieces about it. It's two layers and the aspect ratio and the time on screen, etc. If we click apply, and it's saying, are you sure? Well, I'll say yes, please. And if we click on this button here, you can see things happening there. And it's shown us in the layers as well. Right, let's click on this little magnifying glass. It's taken on the default timing of three seconds from the show underneath. A little bit too slow. Let's swipe across and put in two and click play. You can, of course, while you're in here, sort of change any of these zoom ratios, any of the other bits and pieces, the keyframes, all can be edited from this point here as well. For example, we're working on layer one here. If I click on number two, it's going to take me to the second position. There's the third position. So, of course, you can come in, you can edit, you can change it here as well. And there's the fly up position there. Perhaps just take it a little bit more like that. Right, let's click play again. You notice it will shoot right off the screen now, leaving the image underneath. Once you're happy, you can click Close. Happy with this? You can click OK. That brings us to the one underneath and two seconds. I still feel that's probably a little bit too slow. Let's put in 1.5 so you can edit it right the way through. But now when you click and play, off it goes and it is saved as a show style. Right, let's just take a look. If we come back to the show styles, here we are under the show style tab. Let's come and take a look at this. If we come and we drop down or drop up to all categories, it's showing every one we put in. That's the one we're using at the moment. You notice the tick there, but there's all the other categories. So if you thought there was something missing, there they are. Now don't forget, we've also got my own styles. There it is, the green one. That's the one we're using. Now to manage them, click on the Manage Styles. That'll show us these. It'll show us from all the slides as well. Slide styles I hasten to add. To get rid of them, just click on that. Click Remove or click Edit and you can remove it, you can edit it or even try downloading see if there's any new ones available. Once you're happy, click Done. There you go. Click OK to that. And there it is, Slide Styles. Producing a single slide style from a template. Until the next time, happy imaging.
and take care.